talk it out, shut up, talk it out, shut up. Talk it out, shut up, talk it out, shut up. Talk it out, talk it out. Welcome, Welcome to, to the, the Talk, Talk Show. Show. I'm Lydia. And I am Joanne. Yeah. So, I wanted to see what she thought about this. Because I was just now just uh, thinking about this. And I was having an epiphany to you, probably. But we really are opposite in like how we think a lot and it's funny because i think a lot of times when you know so you'll always when we do our you know podcast we do our shows anything you're like well joanne probably feels this way or joanne will do this or joanne's nicer than me or joanne this this so how do you think do you think that's a good thing a bad thing do you feel like it's you know you know how sometimes people are like oh you know like a relationship the opposite attract da, 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 but we're like there's a lot of opposite. Like, we really do think differently. Like, you know what I mean? And I guess, you know, sometimes I guess it could be a good thing, could be a bad thing, could make it a wide range for, you know, different opinions for things or whatever when people are trying to ask questions and stuff. But what do you think about it? Do you think that's a good thing? Do you think it's a bad thing? Do you feel like it's bad when you're in business with someone who is that way? You know what I mean? Like, don't really I mean for me it's always benefited for me in the sense of you know when I come to you for advice or something like that I know I'm gonna get a very honest opinion you know what I mean not like oh you know just you know, you're gonna tell me what I want to hear you're gonna tell me the truth you're gonna be out you know blunt and honest or whatever no matter what so how do you feel about that do you feel like that's a good thing you feel like you know, or do you feel it's a good thing to be in business with somebody like that, or partner with someone like that? How do you feel? I think it's um, it just it to me it depends on each person. Like, uh, it depends on if everybody's contributing. You're not gonna always think that things through. You can seem like you know a lot of stuff and you don't. So it's like if you guys can uh, contribute whatever the weakness is to the strength. So like. Whatever yeah. I'm strong in is I contribute that in. Whatever you're strong, you contribute. You take over my weak areas, I take over your weak areas, and we combine it. I think it works very well. Okay. I think that the most complications that I've heard most people have is not being able to express themselves without offending somebody else. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And those are things that um, are hard. And also knowing what stays between you mm -hmm. And we can go out to everybody else. Yeah. So it's like, you know, you hear uh, what happens in the, at home stays at home. Yeah. It's the kind of same thing in business. Is what happens in our business stays at our, in our business. Mm -hmm. Because what you, do, what you don't want to do is have other people gravitate into it. Like a marriage, you don't want everybody gravitating mm -hmm. into it. Mm -hmm. Because then that can start a conflict. Because they might not agree Right. to the dynamic of the relationship mm -hmm. but it worked right so then the moment they put their two cents in it it starts yeah. breaking up that dynamic and and yeah and it breaks up that dynamic mm -hmm. in the relationship but there's a lot of communication that needs to be there yeah one thing i also think like um even like for us i think is um that we don't do that we're supposed to do is write out contracts so then we can go buy mm -hmm. that contract and know what our position is mm -hmm. in each field. Yeah. The only time I get upset the most is if I feel like I'm doing this too much over and over again. And then it's like, I oh, don't saying wanna... the same thing over again. Yeah, time, or like, trying to put them all or trying try to be heard. Not just trying to be heard because I think I'm heard. It's just like, but nothing happens. Mm. You know, so those are the things that we like. Uh. Mm. I even get it like when I'm doing it with the kids. It's like, uh, okay, we. If we're going to set goals to do this, let's just do the goals. Mm -hmm. And we stay on those goals because mm -hmm. I can invest a lot of my time to do the research and figure it out. But if I feel like I'm doing it on my own, yeah. then I get tired. Yeah, yeah, and then I just don't want to do it because I feel like I'm taking over. Mm -hmm. Which I don't want to ever feel like I'm taking over because I feel like it's a team thing and that's I think where a lot of issues come in because if one person's taking over then the other people are going to feel like they're not really participating but that's hard for me not to not have that I guess what it is is I think you don't realize how strong of a personality you have so sometimes even if it's not meant for you to take over 
the person you're going to be a person who's that leader role because that's the personality and so people will take their take their role they'll take their okay well this, this is what i'm supposed to do da, 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 da. she's the she's got the strong personality she's telling us what we need to do da, 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 and then they do it it has it, even though it but may seem it like works, that. No, but it works if they're doing it. Yeah. But if you're doing. if you're sitting up there and you're taking the strong wall and nobody's doing it, yeah, then sure. you're over. Yeah, it's like sure. to me, it's like overstepping the boundaries mm -hmm. of the relationship. Mm -hmm. Is you know, because if I oh okay, I'm the leader, then usually if I'm the leader, then everybody will follow the leader. The suit. <laughs> yeah. yeah, but if ain't nobody following the leader, then there's really no leader, <laughs> yeah. and there's this. One person thinking they know everything <laughs> and it does not work out. So, you know, those are things. So but those so happen like, in all kinds of groups and relationships. Those are things that have to be, yeah. like, said. I, now, you said an example. One example is a good one. It's the salt and pepper one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Or Spinderella. Yeah. And it's like, you never made sure to put that in a contract mm -hmm. with what you want. Right. So, they're doing what... Their contract is saying, but you want them to go outside of the contract to do what you want them to do, mm -hmm. and it's not in the binding contract. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And so that's where I'm like, for me, it's like, okay, I would do so much more than what I do, mm -hmm. but I feel like I'm overstepping my boundaries. So I have, like, even in our, like, family dynamic mm -hmm. relationship, I just die down because yeah. I, like, I'm not... I don't want to force anybody to do something they don't want to do. Mm -hmm. So my thing is, if you guys want to do it, then you'll finally, you heard me before, so yeah. you'll finally do it. Yeah. But there's so much more that I could take. Yeah. I could take the us to a whole nother the level, level. Yeah. But I can't take this to a whole lo nother level because I can't do it by myself. Right, right. I don't have, I know for a fact that I don't have the skills mm -hmm. to do a lot of the stuff that I want to take us to a level. Mm -hmm. And I know everybody has their skills. If they combine it all, it can't get If you. everybody worked their skills yeah. together, we wouldn't be here. Yeah. We would be here. Yeah. But everybody stay here, so yeah. then I might as well stay here. Yeah. And so now what I do mm -hmm. is I started um, just focusing and saying, okay, this is what we're going to do mm -hmm. as the group. And mm -hmm. then I'm like, okay, I'm going to have to really work on my business because I do want my business to grow. Mm -hmm. And then when everybody else is ready for their business to grow, then I'll jump right back in mm -hmm. and help grow. Mm -hmm. Because I, I get frustrated yeah. because yeah. I have a vision, mm -hmm. but it's again, it's my vision. Mm -hmm. But I have a vision of us like soaring mm -hmm. to the next level and mm -hmm. being this dynamic mm -hmm. business yeah. family where we can really build a empire, empire. a kingdom of, you know, mm -hmm. a stop. But it's, I need everybody else to be ready to do it too. Right. And until then, all I could do is say, okay. How can I focus on what I want to do mm -hmm. for me and my business until I figure? Because literally, y'all might not know this, or you might not know. I don't know what the hell I want to do. Mm -hmm. Like I don't. That's mm -hmm. why I do so many, so different, do things. So many different things. Because I don't know. But what the good thing do. about it is she's blessed. And she's got lots of talent. So whatever she put her hands on, at least it it always works. So like, I think she it would work more in. if I would put my bless mind you. onto one day. <laughs> bless you, bless you. Bless you. If I put my mind on one, one thing, thing it, yeah. it, put it, it in. all into one. All yeah. that energy. But I'm all over here, 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 here. So some of the stuff that it takes, it, it goes in the back seat. Yeah. So yeah, if I can I just like get that. focused on what I truly like to do. And I don't know what I truly like to do. I like to do everything. She likes to do a lot of stuff. I do. Right. And she's good at it all. Oh, yeah, that. Well, I try. Yeah. Well, that's a good conversation. Think about what you guys want to do. Think about your situation. You may have, or who you may be in business with, partners mm -hmm. with, whatever. And um, think about those things. Comment. Tell us what you think about this uh, this topic. And I understand that too. That with your business partner mm -hmm. or your family or stuff like that, everybody has a strength, mm -hmm. and you want everybody to work in their strength. And everybody has a story. Mm -hmm. So in their story, you got to work within that storyline mm -hmm. too. They might not have the mindset to say, I could put everything inside over here and focus on right, this. Right. They might have all these other dynamics in there. You can go, well, we're all in the same, same, same family. Yeah, but we all got, we you all know, deal. with our own families. Yeah, too, and, and we all deal stuff. with different, yeah. different things, different ways. Yes. So as a business partner, you... It's a marriage, mm -hmm. and you have to be able to work in that marriage, but mm -hmm. you don't want to, uh, to me, there are a lot of reasons why 
men or women cheat is because they're not always satisfied. And that's how you cheat in a relationship mm -hmm. in a business too. Yeah. And that's why you see businesses separate and then they have to go with their own separate names mm -hmm. and all the other stuff because the communication is not there and the feelings can't be um, acknowledged because other people won't get in their feelings if you give your feelings. Mm -hmm. it's, it's a dynamic that it takes a lot to mm -hmm. understand mm -hmm. and work together. But it can work and it can be the best thing ever. I promise you again. Mm -hmm. It's just something that you have to work on, work on and focus. Okay. And if you guys are on the same team, is the faster you can grow. Mm -hmm. The faster you can grow is by being on the same team. But if you um, get that jealousy that most black people get mm -hmm. and look at somebody else kind of sore and then mm -hmm. you get jealous and then you say, I'm going to go over here. And so you're no, no longer working mm -hmm. together. Yeah. That will damage the relationship and then that won't mend it. Mm -hmm. It will damage it. And, and that's what it is. Right. So think about that before you get in a relationship or a business partnership because those things are so mm -hmm. important to make. A connection with and it's so hard to get people to understand that's what you're doing as well mm -hmm. and it's hard to do it in a marriage a friendship a business partnership your kids partnership every partnership there is it's hard to get that there because we have never learned mm -hmm. how to communicate and how to take mm -hmm. communication that might not be a pleasant receivable mm -hmm. information yeah hold each other accountable Let's hold each other accountable. All right. We'll see you next time on Talk It Out Show. Talk It Out. It's the Talk It Out Show.